Hey folks, welcome to episode two, of my 5K to 50K, The Revenge. I'm working on that. Um, so it's been a couple weeks. Uh, I've been uh, doing some short stuff, but I haven't really gone any long stuff. We've been uh, trying to just get that business uh, moving and we're doing a lot of pop-ups and working a lot of hours. So I've been doing short burst runs. This is my first one. I'm just finishing up a long one uh, today. Um, I can tell that it's been several weeks. I can tell probably gained a couple LBs on this one. So, um, so a lot of ask, a lot of people ask me like, so how do you, you know, these are long days. How do you do it? And it's, I guess the best way to describe it is you sort of want to get to this sort of fatigue plateau. Uh, it's the best way to describe it. So the first hour I start hitting that kind of fatigue plateau, which is, it's not going to get any easier, but it's not going to get that much harder. And I want to stay there. So for the last, uh, the last one I did, unfortunately, I spent about four hours in that fatigue plateau, which is great. I needed five hours in that fatigue, uh, fatigue plateau. It ended up spiking again, and I couldn't get it back down, and that's what caused me to pull up short. So really, what I'm training for is I'm training to just get used to being in that zone. In that, yeah, I'm fatigued. Yeah, I'm tired, but it's just it's going to stay there. Um, it's going to. It's not going to feel good, but it's not going to be so painful. You have to stop. You may have to, you know, walk a little bit more hills than you're used to, but whatever. But that's kind of the goal to get prepped. Uh, you know, shout out to Tim from Multisports Endurance Academy. He's doing my training plan again. Fantastic job. We're not starting from zero. We're starting from kind of where I left off. Unfortunately, I've lost about a week, week and a half of just not focusing. So I think any slack that I have is no longer there. So. We are on our way to December 13th for 50K. Hey, it's a beautiful day out here in Harlandsdale, so I may be tired, but hey, it's not upsetting, I'll guarantee you that. So, like below, try to follow us. Stay food for episode three. Woo!